हॅलो एव्हरी वन आय एम अपर्णा कुलकर्णी अँड आय एम बॅक विथ माय न्यू व्हिडिओ ऑन कन्फर्मेशन्स ऑफ अल्केन्स इन अर्लियर व्हिडिओज वी हॅव सीन हाऊ टू ड्रॉ प्रोजेक्शन्स टाईप्स ऑफ स्टिरिओ एसमर्स अँड देअर नोमेन क्लेचर बट धिस टर्म कन्फर्मेशन इज टोटली न्यू टू यू सो आय विल गिव्ह यू वन एक्झाम्पल टू एक्सप्लेन धिस टर्म सो लुक ॲट धिस पिक्चर हिअर person is making movement and various postures of a person are shown in this picture now similarly imagine that a molecule uh, is making movement so molecule will attain various arrangements in uh, space and these arrangements are called as conformations now question is why molecule makes movement so we'll consider one example so consider example of ethane uh, this is a ball and stick model of ethane so as you can see uh, this is carbon uh, attached to three hydrogen second carbon attached to three hydrogen and there is one carbon carbon single bond now uh, this carbon carbon single bond can rotate freely so due to this rotation Uh, this uh, molecule will attain various uh, arrangements in space and these arrangements are called conformation with this knowledge now we'll see definition for conformation conformations are simply different structural arrangements of the same molecule that result from rotation about carbon carbon single bond these conformations are also called as conformational or rotational isomers or conformers remember students conformations can be discussed only for those organic molecules which possess at least two carbon atom directly attached means at least one carbon carbon single bond thus the simplest alkene for which we can discuss conformation is ethane so let us now discuss conformations of ethane the best projection to study conformation is newman projection in newman projection we uh, hold molecule like this means this carbon carbon bond we hold perpendicular to plane of paper and uh, we watch molecule from this side for detailed discussion about how to draw newman projection you can watch my video stereochemistry basics newman projection link is given in description box initially suppose ethane molecule is like this uh, you can see uh, front carbon and three hydrogens attached to it you cannot see back carbon and back uh three hydrogens as they are exactly behind the front carbon and hydrogen uh this conformation is called as eclipsed conformation now suppose i am rotating the back carbon or carbon carbon bond through 60 degree i am keep, keep, keeping front carbon as it is and i am rotating back carbon through 60 degree so now watch molecule now you can see front carbon three hydrogens and you can see back three hydrogens as well back three hydrogens as well uh this conformation is called as staggered conformation and now suppose if i keep moving uh, uh, carbon carbon bond through 60 degree suppose i again move carbon carbon bond now again you can see only uh, front uh, hydrogens so this is eclipse conformation now suppose again i uh, rotate through 60 degree now you can see all the hydrogens so this is staggered conformation thus the two, two extreme conformations that ethane molecule can have are eclipse conformation and staggered conformation so here uh conformations of ethane eclipsed and staggered are shown in sohas projection as you know in sohas projection we look at the molecule from sideways and the carbon carbon bond makes angle with the plane of paper 
Let us now discuss energies associated with these two conformations. In uh, eclipse conformation, uh, all the atoms are at closer distance and all bonds face each other. So there will be a repulsive interaction and uh, energy will be somewhat higher. But if we consider staggered conformation, all atoms are at uh, a distance from each other and a bond is not facing. Therefore, there will be no repulsive interaction and energies will be less. So in short, staggered conformation is more stable than eclipsed conformation. If we plot a graph of potential energy against angle of rotation, the maximas are eclipsed conformation. The energy dif difference between these two conformation is three kilocalorie per mole and uh, one form can be easily converted into other form. So with this, we uh, conclude our discussion about conformations of ethane. In next video, we'll see conformations of butane.